from me. And tonight at Freddy's, I'm going to take it back. Then they can't stop me from being Mid-America champion. And there are the heartbreakers, John Caesar and Larry Valentine with Kenneth Lecter in tow as they hit the ring here on the Devils. And just going at it, this is actually going to be a six-man tag match as the Devils and Chris Danger taking on the Heartbreakers and Cannibal Lecter. If the Heartbreakers lose, the Devils get Lecter back. But Lecter is pretty much hog-tied in the corner. That's right. They've keep them, kept them right where they need him. They're just going to take care of the, uh, the Devils. The Heartbreakers looking for revenge here from what the Devils did to both of them a couple of weeks ago here on NWA Main Event Television and started this match off really quick and Chris Danger wisely staying out of the way. And if you remember, they're, the Heartbreakers are very well rested. They just came back from their little tour of the East Coast at Disney World and then they went to the West Coast, my old town, hometown uh, to Disneyland. Dante working over uh, Larry Valentine, and there's Chris Danger, and Damian going to get them a little bit of John Caesar on the outside, left in the ring. It's Dante Ooh. and Larry Valentine, and they're beating on that head that was already busted open last week in Columbia, Ooh. Tennessee. Look at it! Look at him just Dante. wear out the head of Valentine. Dante going nuts on Larry Valentine. What's that? Well, looks like the hard for it. Well, there's John Caesar coming back now. Caesar in the ring. Valentine gets whipped into the ropes. Closed line there by Dante. Caesar with a back forearm to uh, Damien and then a poke to the eye. Cuts him off and Damien in danger now. Working over uh, John Caesar. Punch right there to the gut as they lift that arm up. Valentine laid out on the ground. His neck still not completely healed from that massive power bomb off the top rope a few weeks ago. Look over in the corner. Can you see? Do you see where I see? It looks like Cannibal Lecter is somehow trying to... Untie the rope so they're tying it that have him held to the uh, ring post. Lecter's been struggling this whole match, looks like trying to get out of those ropes as Valentine just nailing a little payback there for Dante, but Damien's still biting. John Caesar over in the corner and all four men in the ring. I, I, the referees hadn't had control since the opening bell. But, but if Cannibal Lecter gets free, that will make this, in a sense, a three on three. They make it a four on two. You realize the dilemma here? Well, Danger's kind of staying out of the way anyways. Uh, no, Danger, look, he's up there getting ready to jump in any time. Dante getting thrown to the outside and Valentine coming after him. Left in the ring is Damien and John Caesar. It's Valentine lacerated once again that top right above the left eye. And him and Dante trading punches and Dante going for that open wound every single time. Oh, and, oh, oh look, Lecter's cannibal, free. Cannibal's free. Cannibal Lecter got free, he's he's celebrating. Danger just saw him. Danger up in the ring now as Cannibal Lecter has got free. I don't think the Heartbreakers know it yet. Hugging Chris Look. Danger. Wait, wait a minute. What's he doing? A roll up by Cannibal Lecter. One, two, three, counting the, the heart. Wait a minute. The Heartbreakers win? Well, I've heard of uh, kidnapping. A, a, the Heartbreakers win. You've heard of the old stories where when you're kidnapped, you kind of start feeling better and more closer to your you, wait, wait a minute, that's Nick. That, that's that's Nikki Fives, the referee. He's saying the Heartbreakers made him do it. Uh-oh. He's cannibal? Wait a minute. He's got him up. Oh, the close on there. Uh-oh. Look at this. Valentine hits the ring now, trying to protect the poor referee. Stock fucking crash by John Caesar. Remember I was telling you the Heartbreakers are going to return, the ones we knew before. Oh, big neck breaker there by Larry Valentine. Valentine bleeding like a stuck hog in the ring. Well, this is all Dante's fault. If Dante and Damian would not have power slammed him through the table just a few weeks ago. Power bomb. Wait a minute. They, they've got a piece, of, a piece of plywood. It looks like a just a leftover piece of plywood here at the Inferno Bar. Maybe one of their stages or something. You know what they say about paybacks, Lee. They're setting up the plywood in the corner. The Heartbreakers stalking Dante like a wounded beast, picking him up here. The Heartbreakers, oh, oh, did you see him bounce oh. off the table? The, the, that, the, that's the, extra thick plywood. The plywood not even breaking. Let's look at that again. The plywood not even breaking, and Dante bouncing off of it. Back here to live action. They've got him in the money clip. Uh, got Dante smoothing the money clip. We haven't seen them do that in a while either. Damien knocked out from the stock market crash. Can't even help Dante and the money clip applied by the Heartbreakers. 
Now the heartbreakers are Look at the vision to the eyes of Valentine. Uh, I don't think they're done with him. Valentine's uh, looking for blood here. Uh, Stop it. Oh, wait a minute. Now, now. Caesar's setting him up. Caesar with the powerbomb. The 666. Oh, old Dante. They took the devil's own 666, that powerbomb combination. Stop. The heartbreakers are back. The ones I knew before. The ones that held the NWA Mid-America Tag Team titles. Tonight, it's going to be Larry Valentine versus Damian with Chris Danger. The four corners of hell match. A box placed at every corner of the ring in every single box. A different surprise to maim your opponent with. That's tonight, Freddy's Auction House, Columbia, Tennessee, 8 p.m. bell time. Valentine, Damian, four corners of hell tonight in Columbia. Tonight, Columbia, Tennessee, Freddy's Auction